You still have time to get today's Del Mar Life Daily Deal. Today's deal, $23 for an Otterbox commuter iPhone 4 or 4S case with free shipping. And I believe I paid 80 bucks for mine. Don't forget, you can get the Daily Deal on DelmarvaLife.com. Oh, wow. Yeah. <laughs> You've probably seen this video. It's the latest viral sensation on YouTube and Facebook showing NASCAR driver Jeff Gordon in disguise and taking this poor unsuspecting car dealer on the ride of his life. In this age of social media, companies like Pepsi are learning the value of a viral video. And someone else who knows the value of a viral video is Queen Anne's County resident Mally Mujanic. It was two years ago this month that we first saw Denver the Guilty Dog. Denver gained global attention for fessing up to getting in the cat treats. Go get it. On any given day, you can see Denver, an eight-year-old golden retriever, doing what most dogs like to do. Play fetch. We spoil Denver just like most people spoil their pets. Um, she has run of the house. She's really the dominant dog in the house, but she gives all powers to Macy. Macy's older. She she does what she wants. She barks when she wants. There's, we put her outside on the deck when it's nice. But to the rest of the world, Denver is a global sensation what? thanks to this video. Denver, did you do this? Look at me. Come here. Let me see. Let me see your face. Oh my goodness, Denver, you didn't. Two years ago, Mally Vujanic of Millington, Maryland, took the video after finding the empty bag of cat treats on the living room floor. I remember the day that I shot the film. It sat on my camera for eight hours before I even uploaded it. And my wife was in Miami on business and Right at the dinner table with the kids, I was kind of playing home dad and taking care of everything, kids yelling. And I looked at the video for the first time, and that's when I thought, yeah, there's something really cool here. And I purely put it on Facebook just to make a couple of my buddies laugh. Little did he know his buddies would be joined by nearly 40 million people from around the world. YouTube has told us it's a, it's a viral tsunami. The video also caught the attention of late night television. Watch the whole thing because it, it's almost as if these dogs understand English. And national media. But soon what started out as a simple home video turned into something that had to be protected. Then we realized we had something that was our intellectual property, so we had to protect it. We had to hire a lawyer, you know, to copyright and do a trademark on the imagery and anything that associated with it that was ours. That meant shutting down video pirates. If you have a viral video that really has some roots like ours did, th it's your property. Someone is going to take it and use it in some way, shape, or form, whether it's to monetize. Uh, now with YouTube, you can, you can put ads next to it and get a penny a click, two pennies per click. Denver has loyal fans from nearly every country on the planet. Brazil, Holland, Texas, Argentina, Germany. Even I was a little <laughs> starstruck. Okay, here we go. Ready? Oh my gosh, she just took the best picture ever with Denver. And with that much attention, marketers see this dog as a cash cow, but not Mally. We've had offers, we get offers every day from somebody. You know, chocolate milk, somebody, some chocolate milk company was like, let's get chocolate milk on Denver's face. And we turn so much stuff down. We just say thank you, but no thank you. know, dog chews, a little bones and stuff. Oh, there's all kinds of stuff. Doggy toothpaste because <laughs> of the teeth. But, you know, you know, you, you pick and choose. As Denver's agent, Mally, is carefully considering some offers. We're still waiting for that one really cool thing that's a perfect fit. And one of the things that's in the making that absolutely could be that is a line of Denver uh, coloring books for children. And you know, like doodle pads and, and crossword puzzles and just like a fun pads for kids. Mm -hmm. Because of all the things that we've thought about with Denver trying to incorporate her into something. Uh, it's always come back to us that Denver says, tell the truth. And if you think about it, that's really what Denver was doing in that video. So if there's anything that came out of the video, it was more like, hey, I did it. Right now, you can purchase items from Denver's online store. We have an online store where, you know, by popular demand, people asking for t-shirts, they can go on and buy Denver's t-shirt. And then we also have Denver's bandana store where it's popular with the dogs with the little bandanas. Um, and, and we sell them all over the world. In fact, I'm going to ship some to, to uh, uh, Sweden today. 
Part of the profit from the online store is used to cover overhead costs, such as legal fees and bandwidth for the website. The rest has gone to the American Cancer Society and the National Search Dog Foundation. We feel like we did a little bit of good with it, you know. Uh, we paid it forward uh, probably more than most people would have. As for Denver, fame hasn't changed her much. This is really Denver's demeanor. She's, she likes to lay around and do stuff. She's wonderful with our children. She, she'll play. If you grab a tennis ball or one of her dummies, she'll, she'll just get excited, jump around, run around. But it's, we just had this conversation the other day. It's amazing how when folks like you with your crew and everything show up, she just gets so hammed up. She hams it up. She knows, I, I can't explain it, but I, so help me. I mean, she's Denver. I mean, of course she knows. And it's very clear. Mally knows, despite all the attention and fame, what matters most is Denver. And it really does. I found that out. Mally says a lot of people think he and his wife are jet setting around the world, taking Denver everywhere. The truth is they've only taken them one place. Denver and Macy both, they went up to New York City for a television appearance. That's it. Uh, that was, what, two years ago? Mally says Denver prefers to just stay home. Be a homebody, or she's a homebody. <laughs> Staying yeah. home. Yeah. Wow, what yeah. a great story. Well, thanks for watching Delmarva Life. Be sure to join us tomorrow. You may be getting ready to spruce up your home with a fresh coat of paint this spring. Is it really worth the money to buy an expensive paintbrush? Well, we'll find out. It's a subject that men don't necessarily like to talk about, but there's a former football great who says it's okay. A little testosterone. Daryl Morse Johnson, uh, Daryl Moose Johnson talks about the common and easily fixed problem. And gardening expert Jenny Rosencrantz joins us to show us how to make our Easter lilies stay beautiful and vibrant beyond Holy Week. And we're in the kitchen with Harrison's Harbor Watch of Ocean City. Now don't forget, if you missed any of today's information, all you have to do is visit DelmarvaLife.com. Delmarva Life, life at its best here on Delmarva. Now let's give it up one more time for Ashley Oder. Take me for granted, you can take all my gold. Nobody but Jesus is gonna take my soul. Do, do, do. Do, do, do. Walk through darkness, I don't need no Take all my gold, nobody but Jesus is gonna take my soul. Rivers rising, but I got no doubt. My sweet Savior's gonna pull me out. Ain't afraid of nothing. Watching over me. You can't take me for granted. You can't take all my gold. Nobody but Jesus is gonna take my soul. Ain't afraid of nothing because I believe I got a sky full of angels watching over me.